Hey, Air Signs. Uh, this is me, Brandy, from ToriAndI.com. This is just a general I felt like putting together. Uh, so, a real quick message for you guys. There is a lot of creativity supposed to be coming from your subconscious from this um, I want to call it the dark night, so to speak, this limbo that you may be in instead of diving into the pain or the absence of someone, this is more an opportunity to rise from the ash, to turn that pain and that anxiety into a creative genius, so to speak, that you've been blocking out. Okay. And it's like once you start to do that, it's almost like you can mend certain uh, past relationships, possibly even begin again or meet someone who is going to bring pleasure into your life, who is also creative. Because I have nothing but dreamscape here, uh, almost like you're getting information um, through your dreams, through being around water, the bathtub, doing dishes, stuff like that. And you definitely need to stay away from any narcotics, any toxins, um, alcohol, because it clouds judgment. I keep getting like addictions and nervous system issues, okay? However, it's all about expression, where you need to dive into your creative um, fantasy, like to learn how to manifest through creativity, okay? Because I keep getting crowds, I keep getting... Um, mind games uh, from the people that you were dealing with, but it all is leading back to some type of artwork here, okay? Some type of inspiration where your visions are supposed to come to you and they're a little subtle and you're supposed to pay close attention, but you're really not. It's more like you are over here in the darkness of the wound and they're trying to bring you a lot of luck. So maybe if you need to pay close attention, make a dream journal, uh, but I feel this inspiration is going to come to you in literal midst of the ordinary mundane because I kept picking up doing dishes. I kept picking up like washing a car with a water hose, the bathtub. These are where the most inspiring things because you're sitting with yourself is going to take place. So it's like you have been running on idle. And you have to stop being occupied by the past in order to move forward. And I feel like luck will literally be on your side to get you out of those outgrown familiar habits uh, because you're being called to move. Okay, I think this is a good thing. So take the darkness and turn it into the light. Thank you.